Thank you for coming this morning. We're going to make this fairly brief since it's still it's still rather damp. Uh, and I'd like to start by welcoming everybody. I'm Peter Stott from Sustainable Tiverton, and uh, we have Councillor Sue Griggs and her party, the Mayor of Tiverton, who's going to formally open this uh, this new mural uh, that's been created over the last few months. Uh, also with us today, David Sargent from Plymouth University, who has been the leader of the project that has installed a number of public art pieces across Devon over the last few months as part of the Net Zero Visions project, and Councillor Colin Slade from Mid Devon District Council, who own this wall and have been <laughs> and have uh, been very helpful to us in facilitating this um, uh, this in this installation. So I just want to say a few thank yous. So firstly. Thank you to David and his team at Plymouth University who secured the funding that would enable it to happen. Uh, thanks as well to uh, Kate Crawford, uh, who's not unfortunately able to be here today, uh, but it was Kate who actually painted the wall with her, uh, with her colleagues. I'd particularly like to thank Steve Densham of Mid -De Devon District Council, who was extremely helpful to us in, in, in smoothing the way um, to get the various permissions uh, that we required in very quick time uh, and also was able to chip in a bit of money at the end when the budget ran out. Um, and most of all, I would like to thank the Ideas Group. Uh, so that's a group of uh, local people who came together, convened by Sustainable Tiverton, who generated the ideas that you see represented on the wall in front of you. Um, and a number of those people are here. Emily is here. Sally is here, Jeremy is here, and Teresa is here, uh, Ian also is here, uh, Jason and Tim and David, I'm not sure, but thank you everybody for coming, and thank you for the contributions that you made. So that's enough from me, and I'm going to hand over to David. Thank you. I would have dressed up more if I I'll just say a few quick words about the project that this is part of. So, it's Net Zero Visions and it's working with the Devon Carbon Plan. Now really the root idea behind it is that it's easy, to, I think we, it's easy to get stuck in a world of sort of dystopian, pessimistic imagination. Uh, we know things are tough and they're going to be tough, but also that we can do a lot together. And so the idea of the project is to encourage communities to come together and reimagine where they live and share that imagination with the people they live around. So this is just one mural, there's others in Plymouth, there's going to be animations, illustrations, poetry, lots of artworks all across them. And so the Tipton mural hopefully, I mean at the very least it adds a bit of colour to people's lives, but hopefully it also encourages people to think about the amazing things that are happening already in Tipton, as well as the things that could happen if people keep on working, Peter and everyone else who's been involved in the project, if they keep on working and talking and sharing the way they have. So that's enough for me, but really glad to see it here. And now, um, Councillor Slade. Thank you, Peter. Good morning, everybody. And uh, I think despite the weather, we're all delighted to be here. If you're wondering why I'm here, I'm one of those people who wears several hats. I'm actually here today as the Cabinet Member for the Environment and Climate Change at Mid Devon District Council. I'm also a County Councillor and I sit on the climate change standing over group feeding into the Devon Carbon Plan. I'm also delighted to see the horse boat up there because I'm also the chair of the Grand Western Canal Advisory Committee and that is the most sustainable form of transport you can get really. You just put oats and hay in at one end and it'll pull the boat all day. Brilliant. So here we are, it's, I think you'd agree it is a wonderful artwork, it's very powerful and congratulations to Kate Crawford. She's done a fantastic job bringing all these local things to life. And I think we can all draw a little inspiration from all those things that we see, which are part of our everyday life in Tiverton and Mid Devon. And we hope that it inspires further community ideas as we work towards our low carbon future. Now it is always a pleasure for the council to work with community groups and partners from Mid Devon and beyond, such of course as Sustainable Tiverton, the Devon Climate Emergency Group, and the University of Plymouth, who's put such a really good effort into this. It's been a really noteworthy project, and I'd like to add my thanks to everyone's involved. 
If you ask what are we actually doing as a council, well, we've declared a climate emergency. We are taking action towards a net zero future. We're continuing to decarbonise our assets. That includes our leisure centres, of course. Plant as many trees as possible, with over 650 planted since the start of 2021. And we're also currently looking to improve our district's recycling rate with the recent change to our waste collection service. So really, all I can say is here's to a bright and prosperous net zero future. Thank you. Now I'd like to ask the Mayor of Tiverton, Councillor Sue Briggs, to do the honours. I don't know if you want to say a few words and to uh, to open the open the curtains for the for the plaque which will um, uh, give a bit uh, give more information about the mural that's there thank you very much i would like to say how very excited i was when i heard about this project coming to tiverton i think it's wonderful i'm so pleased that it came here and thank you all very much to everybody who's um taken part in designing this and getting it here i, think, I hope it's the start of lots of more murals in the town because i think they really brighten up the town this one makes a great statement that we all need to be observing and hoping to live by. Working together, we can make a huge, huge difference by working together. And I know that Tiverton has really made a good start in doing that. So, without further ado, I'm going to pull these curtains open and... There we are. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you very Thank much you very indeed. Much. There's just one one final thing that I would like to mention to everybody while they're there. You'll see on the mural there's a QR code here. If you um, use your smartphone uh, to photograph that, it will take you to a series of links. One of them is the Sustainable Tiverton website, and another is a description of the various ideas uh, that sit behind the painting in front of you. Um, and that's well worth reading. We couldn't go through all that this morning. We'd have been here too long. But do have a look at that. You'll also find there links to other uh, net zero projects in Devon, uh, which you might want to visit in due course. So thank you very much, everybody. I'll let you get out of the rain.